Hello viewers, how are you? And if you are new here, please don't forget subscribe. Let's start the story. At the glorious and breathtaking Friday evening, the beautiful and lovely young Princess Harriet reached the most awaited 1805 LIVE concert alone. There was tension and convoy that gave the message that the night was for celebrating heroes from the community. They had wowed the audience with a dance the previous year during the appreciation show for the brave first responders of Santa Barbara holding Mark's hands was Harriet. This year, however, circumstances had been different. Mark was unable to attend the concert because he was not feeling well. With their two young children navigating school life, an environment notorious for its germs, it was no surprise that illness had struck. Nevertheless, Harriet was determined to show her support. As the concert commenced, the crowd buzzed with anticipation, filled with local celebrities and community members eager to contribute to the cause. The event raised crucial funds for the area's fire, police, and sheriff departments, ensuring they had the necessary resources to serve and protect. When it was time for Harriet to take the stage, she was met with warm applause. She presented an award to Lauren Courtney, a dedicated air support pilot for Santa Barbara County, whose commitment to his job was evident. With over 22 years of military service and more than 10,000 flight hours, Courtney was a true hero in every sense. Harriet beamed as she spoke about Courtney's dedication, noting, You rarely see your family because you're always flying helicopters. The audience listened intently, captivated by the stories shared that night. Courtney recounted a particularly harrowing rescue from the snowy mountains of Colorado. He spoke of a group of skiers who had veered off course, leading to a dangerous situation. We never leave anybody behind, he emphasized, recalling the intense effort it took to save a skier who had suffered a severe head injury. Thanks to their teamwork, the skier not only survived but later proposed at the Grand Tetons, a testament to the resilience of the human spirit. As the applause roared, Harriet took a moment to reflect on the night's significance. There are people here tonight who are alive because of you, she said, her voice filled with emotion. From everyone here, thank you so much. Although Mark's absence was felt, Harriet's presence shone brightly, reaffirming her commitment to the community. The actress who hosted the event clearly held the couple in high regard, and there was hope that they would both be invited back next year. Also, some well-known figures were present in the company of the guests, among them Cameron Diaz, Zoe Saldana, and Pink, whose presence made the evening even more glamorous. Harriet was dressed in a tailored blazer that added an effortlessly chic touch and subtly striped button-down that was dark stylish. Sassy was the right word to describe Harriet's fashion choice. One couldn't help but wonder if Mark had played a role in selecting her outfit. After all, their style seemed perfectly coordinated. And again, the concert went on as the audience enjoyed music and laughter, and the thrilling spirit of the evening made sure that it was a night that would live with all the present for years to come. So viewers, this story ends now, and don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. Thanks for watching.